Howdy there folks, it's Amelia from Sleepopolis, and today we're going to be comparing two popular mattresses both specifically designed with heavy sleepers in mind, the Brooklyn Bedding Titan Plus and the Big Fig. Heavy sleepers who weigh 250 pounds or more tend to need a sturdier and more supportive mattress than average and lightweight sleepers to ensure they're getting the proper support they need. If you're a heavy sleeper looking for the best mattress, you might be deciding between these two beds. So in this video, I'll be going over how they feel, what they're made of, and who they're best suited for. Before we get started, I do want to let you know that mattress brands, including the ones featured in this video, send us beds for free to review and to tell you about. If you buy either of these beds using our links in the description, we may earn a commission at no additional cost to you. That helps us to fund our testing and bring you these reviews for free. Okay, let's get into it. First things first, let's go over what makes these mattresses similar. Both the Big Fig and Titan Plus are hybrid mattresses, meaning they both use foams and coils in their construction. Next, both of these beds are good options for couples. And finally, both the Big Fig and Titan Plus are good options for stomach sleeping. Now that we've covered similarities, let's look at some key differences between these beds. First up, the Big Fig sleeps cooler than the Titan Plus, so it might be a better choice for hot sleepers. Next, the Big Fig comes with a 20-year warranty, while the Titan Plus comes with a lesser 10-year warranty. Finally, the Titan Plus is less expensive than the Big Fig at full retail, so it might be a good choice for budget shoppers. But you can save money on both these mattresses by clicking the link in the description of this video. Now let's dive in deeper, taking a look at the materials used in each of these beds. First up, the covers. The Titan Plus's quilted cover is made of polyester quilted with foam, so it's soft and cozy, but can run a bit hot. To mitigate this heat, you can add a special cooling panel, which is made with cool-to-the-touch face change material, but this is for an additional charge. The cover of the Big Fig is a thermogel knit blend that has a plush feel. The fabric is blended with a gel material that helps with temperature regulation by dissipating body heat. Next up, the comfort layers. The Titan Plus has a 2-inch layer of proprietary Titan Flex foam. This latex alternative has a quick, responsive bounce that provides a natural lift to the structure to help keep heavier folks positioned more on top of the mattress than in it. The Big Fig's top layer is a gel-infused latex foam that is aerated to allow airflow throughout the mattress. The Big Fig has a transition layer of three separate one-inch layers of high-density polyfoam. These layers are pretty firm to provide support and have a quick response to pressure to help give some bounce to the mattress and prevent a stuck feeling. Now onto the support layers. The Big Fig has a support layer of individually wrapped coils. The Titan Plus's support layer consists of a six-inch section of 961 Titan caliber encased coils. These heavy-duty coils give the mattress its firm support. Underneath the coils, both these beds have base layers. The Big Bigs is a thin layer of polyfoam, and the Titan Pluses is two inches of high-density foam. Additionally, the Big Fig has a layer of high-density polyfoam surrounding the pocketed coil support system. This edge foam is a firm layer that is meant to support weight so the sleeper won't collapse the edge of the mattress if they roll near the side. Now let's go over the firmnesses of these two beds. Here at Sleepopolis, we rate firmness on a scale from 1 to 10, where 1 is as soft as a slipper and 10 is as hard as steel-toed boots. We use 6.5 as the standard for medium firm. Our testers rated the Big Fig an 8 out of 10 on the firmness scale, meaning it's a pretty firm mattress. And they rated the Titan Plus a 7.5 out of 10, so it's a little bit less firm than the Big Fig, but still pretty firm. Now let's go over how these beds will feel while you're laying in different sleeping positions. Your primary sleeping position is an important consideration when you're shopping for a mattress as different positions require different levels of pressure relief or support from a mattress. For back sleepers, most mattresses can work well as long as it is comfortable and supportive. For side sleepers, we usually recommend something a little softer for pressure relief at the shoulders and hips. And for stomach sleepers, we usually recommend something a little firmer to keep the hips propped up and in line with the rest of the spine. Let's talk about back sleepers first. Back sleepers should feel comfortable and supported on both these beds, although lighter people who weigh 130 pounds or less might find them firmer than heavier average people. Next up, side sleepers. Heavy and average side sleepers should do okay on both these beds, but if they have a lot of shoulder or hip pain, may want to opt for something softer. Lightweight sleepers will probably find both beds too firm. And finally, stomach sleepers. We think both these beds are great choices for stomach sleepers of all sizes. Now let's take a look at the results from one of our tests, the pressure map test. We use a heat mapping pressure map to show where pressure is building up on different parts of the body while lying in different positions. Blues and greens indicate low pressure, while reds and oranges indicate high pressure. Looking at the big fig, there's mostly blues and greens, which overall indicates low pressure. However, looking at the side, there's definitely some pressure buildup on this tester's hip, so side sleepers with sensitive joints might not find this bed to be a good fit. 
On the Titan Plus, we mostly see blues and greens, indicating overall low pressure in both side and back sleeping. However, our tester did note feeling more pressure on the shoulder than the pressure map reflects. Two other tests we use to assess beds are motion isolation and edge support. Both of these tests are extra important for couples shopping for a bed. Now, motion isolation refers to how well a bed prevents motion from transferring across the bed. Good motion isolation means that you won't be awoken by your partner's movements throughout the night. Edge support refers to how well the perimeter of the bed bears weight. Good edge support means the bed won't dip down or sag if you sit or lie along the edge. For motion isolation, both of these beds had great results, so you are unlikely to feel a partner's movements. For edge support, the Titan Plus tested well, but the Big Fig definitely stood out as the stronger edge support. This makes sense since it does have the reinforced edges. With all that in mind, let's go over who these beds might be a good option for, starting off with the Titan Plus. First up, the Titan Plus is a good option for back sleepers as it offers a nice mix of pressure relief and support. We also recommend it for stomach sleepers as it has firm enough support to keep their hips lifted up and in line with the rest of their spine, promoting a healthy spinal alignment. Additionally, budget shoppers might prefer the Titan Plus over the Big Fig as it is less expensive. However, you can save money on both these beds by clicking our links in the description below. And who should get the Big Fig? First up, we recommend the Big Fig for couples because of its excellent motion isolation, sturdy edge support, and great cooling capabilities. Second, speaking of cooling, we recommend the Big Fig for hot sleepers because it has some great cooling materials like perforated foam, gel, and tall breathable coils. And finally, we especially recommend the Big Fig for heavy back and stomach sleepers. Well folks, that is it for this comparison between the Titan Plus and the Big Fig mattresses. Ultimately, I can't make your decision for you, but I hope this comparison was helpful on your journey towards finding the best mattress for you. If you wanna learn more about either of these beds or see some more great options, just click the link in the description or head over to sleepopolis.com. Hit that subscribe button and I will see you next time. Bye.